Yo, 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 it's your boy the SRT Golf back on your screen with another legendary video, man. Woo! Man, it is crazy. Oh my god, we are on our way to the gym. Holy shit. We are on our way to the gym. On our way to the gym. Just got fuel in this tank, man. The gas prices are going crazy. Man, we gotta fucking chill out on the gas prices, alright, guys? Jesus. It's like 60 some dollars to fill this thing, man. You are breaking the bank. You know what I mean? $60 to go 10 miles in this car, man. It's crazy. But anyways, we're on our way to the gym. We are going to hit back today. Heavy back, light back. I don't know. Y'all pay attention. Make sure you guys pay attention to that and see what we do. But, man, I just want to say thank you to everybody that's been subscribing to the channel. Seriously, I appreciate you all from the bottom, man. It's uh, The channel's been going a little bit crazy the last the last couple weeks. So, man, I, I, pr I appreciate everybody that's been rocking with me. Um, I hope that I'm bringing something to you guys that, that is interesting, whether it's the fitness stuff, whether it's the car stuff, whether it's just motivational speaking, whatever it is, man. I, I truly appreciate everybody that's been rolling with me. Um, we got a lot of big shit coming up in the next in the next month for sure. Um that is just going to be really setting the title for for different types of things so i'm really excited about it i can't wait to tell you guys about everything and what's going down so just make sure you're paying attention to the videos make sure you hit that subscribe button also make sure you hit the ding button that makes that bitch go ding when i put something out um seriously man everybody that's been local here has been rocking with me with going to these car shows and, and sh showing me a lot of love. So man, to every single one of you guys that I have met in the last month in person, I appreciate y'all more than y'all know because you guys are motivating me to keep doing what I'm doing and showing you all that man, I'm an average fucking dude, man. I'm not out here being a millionaire. I ain't out here fucking doing shit. I work hard and grind every fucking day. So I want you guys to understand that you guys keep working, you guys keep grinding, you can reach your dreams and goals. It don't matter what the fuck it is, man. I don't give a shit about these cars. If you don't want it to be a car, it doesn't need to be a car. It could be a business, it could be a house, it could be shit, moving into your first apartment. Whatever the case may be, it is, go for that shit. You know what I'm saying? These, these, these times are hard right now. In the last year and a half, we've experienced a lot of shit, every single one of us, including yourself. So. Go for your goals. Go for your dreams. Don't let anybody tell you some bullshit. If I was listening to people back in back then tell me what I should and shouldn't do, fuck, I wouldn't be here today. And honestly, I'm living a fucking amazing ass life. Um, and I, I can't thank everybody around me that's uh, been supporting me. So, with that being said, let's get to the gym. Let's get this blood flow. Let's get this workout and continue on with the day, man. Let's go get it. going to show you a close grip pull down i'm going to use the cable machine you can use any really any bar you want i'm just using this one because it's accessible and it's here but i want to show you guys do these turn your, your hands backwards not like this but i'm like this and pull down but see how close i am to the chest here go back up come down down to the chest. Squeeze at the bottom, stretch all the way to the top, squeeze at the bottom. So get your lats. This is a huge lat workout. Get some good too. Remember guys, it's all desired weight. Don't go out there pushing a heavy, a lot of heavy weight. You're just gonna hurt yourself. Work your way up, get the form down, and let's get it. I wanna show you a little tricep workout that I do with back. I use a single rope on the swivel top. Now, when this, this obviously swivels, right? So I always pull it to the side and then come down. 90 degree, come down. 90 degree, squeeze at the bottom, back up. Squeeze at the bottom, back up. Now you only want to come up to a 90 degrees. There's no need to come all the way up here. It does nothing. The more tension that you keep on your arm and your tricep, the better. Boom. Try to get 10 to 15 reps. Again, it's not about the weight. It's about the reps and the form. Get that squeeze. Get 
that to poke out. I gotta work on that, man. I'm getting a little flabby, you know what I'm saying? But make sure that you guys also don't put a lot of stress on it because what it's gonna do is gonna give you uh, elbow tightness, and that's not a good thing. When you get your elbow starts cracking, it starts hurting. 90% of the time, it's from doing triceps. Tricep workouts over the head, all kinds of different things. So when you're doing triceps, make sure you're doing it nice and smooth. Don't be jerking. Don't be going super heavy. I do the single one. You can do two, the two-sided rope. You can do whatever you want, but I do the single one so I know that I'm focused on that one muscle at a time. So we have the Techno Gym. This is gonna be the low pull is what they call the machine, but there's various, obviously you guys can see there's various different things that you guys can do with this. But I'm gonna show you one that gets your rear delts, your traps, and your upper lat as well. Now you're not gonna be able to do a lot of weight with this because the cable, the cable resistant on this is, is pretty heavy. So when you come in, Grab the machine, grab the, the handles, they twist, they do it, they're all on cables. As you guys know, I love cables. So here we go, we're gonna come up and out. Back down, up and out. As you guys can see, it's working with the rear delts, the traps, the shoulders, the lats. This hits a lot of different body parts all in one. I usually do this one when I do back. Like I said guys, again, you're not going to be able to pull a lot of weight like that because there's a lot of tension on your shoulders and your traps. So when you're coming in, squeeze. And I can tell you right now, I can already feel it in my, my rear delts and my traps big time. It does hit your lats on that motion. If you do a different motion, you're going to hit more of the lats. But on that motion, you're more focused on your rear delts, your tries, uh, and your traps. It does hit your lats a little bit, but that's uh, the low pull machine, a different variant. Some of the back workouts that we did today, again, I can't show you everything, man. It's all about little tidbits, little, little, little sparkles in there. But uh, I just want you guys to know that I am not a professional trainer. I have, I've never went to school for it, so I don't, I'm not out here trying to claim that I am. I'm just out here trying to help the people that want to learn. Um, in my opinion, you don't have to be a personal trainer to know some, some of the machines and some things that work. Um, like I said, the stuff works for me. It might not work for you guys. It might work for you, it might not. There, there's so many different variants of why it would, why it wouldn't, and so forth. I just want to try to give you guys the basic knowledge uh, of different types of machines that you might see in your gym and you might not. You know, there's gyms that uh, we go to that have those exact machines, and then there's other gyms that don't even have them. So there's a, a good reason of why those machines at that gym are there and that gym there is one of the elite gyms really in the country I would say um, and that's why they have a lot of the, the cable machines and that, that type of stuff that type of stuff it's very hard to hurt yourself on machines but doable don't get me wrong it is definitely doable to hurt yourself on a machine so I just want to show you guys some, some stuff as we work out in some of my videos and stuff like that I get a lot of questions about it I get a lot of questions about eating Maybe um, at some point in my podcast, I will have some some fitness people on there with um, that know a lot more knowledge than me. Because I like again, I don't know everything, and there's a lot to learn. But there's people that I know that know a lot. They went to school for it. They've done it for years and so forth. So maybe watch out for the podcast on that. I might have some people on there for 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 those questions and all of that. If I can't answer them, we'll get the answer for you. So. With that being said, the workout was great. My back is feeling good. I'm feeling stretched out. Time to go eat. And if you guys know me, after big workouts, I gotta go have sushi. Sushi is my thing. It's my jam. 